Ah. And who are you supposed to be? Uh, tell me about yourself. Oh, I should have been one of the greats, but here I am gathering peasants to watch peasants perform broadside pageants for peanuts. <laughs> um, you've got a pretty bad case of the hiccups here. No, really? I hadn't noticed. If not for this ridiculous condition, you'd know me as the king's favorite thespian. Uh, where can I find material to perform? Don't you have an impressive library here in Sicil? I'm sure that beast of a librarian could rustle something up for you. Huh. Stage master, are you? Perhaps I'd like to perform a show. Katarina's given the go-ahead, has she? Oh, very well then. Tell me when you're ready to begin and I'll show you to your places and gather you whatever crowd of drunken yokels can be prevailed upon to watch you flail about on stage. All right, I'm ready. Ready for your trial by fire, you mean? <laughs> There's no more savage foe than an audience, my dear. But I'm sure you'll do just fine. May the show begin. Two-man show. And I'd like to be the king of Stormfist, but I haven't got the credentials, have I? Come back when you've found some material okay. worthy of my stage. Gotcha. Will do. Hello, sir. Who are you? You there. Sit. Stay a while. Right in front. I'll excite you. I'll delight you. I'll beguile you. I'll besmile you. I'm Cedric the Sensational, and I'm... I'm... I'm playing to an empty audience. Tell me about yourself. Don't pity me. No, sir. Just a few years ago, I was the all-singing, all-dancing, all-sensational darling of the town. People came from far and wide just to witness my amazing act. Oh, did they? When Reginald came, he brought some fantastic prop with him. Now, have you seen it? A talking head. Now, I never expected a silly gimmick like that to be my main comment. Tell me about the competition. It seems even my usually choosy audience has been taken in by that hat's little gizmo. I'm a man of skill, sleight of hand, feats of wit, and pure entertainment. This curio <laughs> is ruining what used to be an art. And even when there's no crowd to speak of, old Reggie still has at least one fan calling Bravo and Hee Haw! Sure as the sun sets, that one devotee attracts five more, and those five more all curious about the commotion. I don't know how he inspires such loyalty with less talent contained between his hat and his boots than I've in my crusty handkerchief. Warming the crowd. We met Cedric, a frustrated entertainer at the fair, who told us he was desperate to attract a crowd. Oh. Oh, a named character. Ha! What are you looking at me for? There's a great show going on right in front of you, and look. There stands the world-famous Reginald the Entertainer. Better check it out if you don't want to miss the time of your life. Uh-huh, ah, tell me about yourself. I'm nothing but your average man taking in the best show I've ever seen. I'm amazed and astounded that for a meager gold coin or two, I can take in this first-rate entertainment all day long. 
Same show all day long? That seems a bit much. Well, I've stumbled into quite the fine gig. I just let my appreciation for Reggie's work be known, and he slips me a few gold coins in return. My voice happens to carry pretty far. Cyseal hears me. Cyseal wants to see what the fuss is all about. And let me tell you, this amazing show just can't be beat. My crowd's a little lackluster. Would you mind working for... It is said working uh, your magic for my show? Well, drawing a crowd's what I do best. And I'd be glad to do it for your little show. 100 gold up front, and yours will be the hottest ticket in Cyseal. Sounds reasonable. Here, take this gold. 98, 99, 100. Looks like all's in order, Chief. So, ready for a bigger crowd than you can shake a stick at? Stand back and watch this. War machines. My it word! Come on! Can't you hear the stage calling you? A familiar face. Come watch the show. I promise it'll take your mind off beheading baddies. Haven't you heard? Reginald uses a, cr uh, a crowd warmer. I, a person whose sole job is to praise the performance and stir a crowd. A genius invention. No wonder Reginald has had such success. I knew his act couldn't have outshone mine on its merits alone. Please, you must hire him for me. Imagine the scowl on that con man's face when my rightful audience returns. Gotcha. Performers, showmen, show all of them. <laughs> so let's talk to him first. Oh, well, I've stumbled into quite... Talk to him. Ah, a familiar eye. A person whose sole job is. Please, you must hire. All right, now. Fantastic. My word. By the way, how much gold do I have? What are you looking at me for? There's a great show going on right in front of you. And look. Would you be interested in warning with the crowd for Cedric over there? Well, I don't see why I should. Reginald and I have grown rather friendly, you know? And in any case, it'll be hard to pull myself away from this fantastic show. Persuade this character by charming, intimidating, or reasoning. If your perception is high enough, you can see in the brackets what answer grants the highest bonus. Oh. Fantastic. I propose. I suppose. A professional like yourself would have enjoyed the challenge. Win a series of rock, paper, scissors matches to convince the other party, but well, put points in charisma to gain advantage. Press space to skip the RPS. I guess it's been long enough since I've stretched my wings a bit. And it ain't so far of a flight now, is it? Maybe I will have a peek at what Cedric's up to over there. Fantastic. Today, I think, as king. For you there. You look like an actor just waiting for his big debut. Ah, a familiar face. Showman, show all of them. Sci seal, what you're made of. Hey, it's you again. I don't have to tell you that Cedric's act will help you banish belly fat and inspire your kids to say no to drugs. You there. You look like an actor just waiting for his big debut. <laughs> Trotting off to. Don't they want to hear how the story ends? Doesn't 
anyone care about the oldest dragon knight of Rivalon and his machines of rainbow ribbon war? What? Strange! You appear to be my only client. Did the whole of Sicil eat some bad chicken, or what? How about your competition, Cedric? I knew that fool could never have garnered so much as a guffaw on his own merits. I'll see to this matter immediately. Do re mi fa, it won't be the wo- <clears throat> Got him! This is the finest show in the land! Come on! Come on! Can't you hear the stage calling you? It's all over now! Without my clients, I'll starve! I'll be thrown into the cold! I'll have to sell my favorite silk under things just to pay for firewood! This inbred fool of a monkey has ruined me! <laughs> Let's discuss your There's crowd one. old saying in show business. If your benches are empty once, they'll be empty forever. Looks like old Reginald's reputation is wrecked. How about your competition? Don't speak that name in my presence. I'm certain he's either bewitched or bribed my crowd away from me. I'll take my leave. All right. <laughs> Okay. Come on. Come on. This has gone well. This has gone well. Headless Nick. We managed to sneak away the head while Reginald was distracted. Ooh. speaking in the privacy of the cellar there are eyes and ears everywhere where can i find reginald's you house the healers clinic don't you oh uh, what's his name Teleron. yes um, behind Teleron's house of healing along the cliffs you'll find reginald's sparse little shack there i know we won't be overheard he keeps a spare key right near the place in a pen guarded by a rather lonely little sheep you can't miss the bugger not here, not it won't be the worst. Okay. What was that at? Oh, right They go all the way up there. That might be the key I'm looking for. Original spare key. Yep. seller to talk to uh, uh, talk in privacy
Which of you is more deserving of life? Come, make your case. Uh, how did that? This isn't Reginald Seller. Come, Source Hunter, we must have problems. Not here, not now. You... Mm, a sparse little shack. Oh, it's okay. A spare key. Not here. It won't be the. Oh, I must be talking about this. Here we are. Ah, oh, a little privacy at last. Out of earshot of that contemptible jester, we can finally speak freely. Where shall we begin? Tell me about yourself. My true name is Nick. In life, I was an entertainer aboard the ship of the famed Pontius Pirate. I once dared to defy him, and he savagely beheaded me for the attempt. Uh. Did I know the abuse was only beginning? A wandering sorcerer, mad as the day is long, found my severed head on the beach and resurrected me. I spent months in his company, listening to him blather on about his every inane opinion. When I asked him to return my head to my body, it, it must be in the Black Cove still, he became enraged and tossed my head into the sea. Reginald stumbled upon me some days later and consigned me into his horrid little show. I know not how long I've been entertaining slack-jawed imbeciles at the size seal fair. All I know is I just can't take you anymore. Oh. Uh, you, you want to be reunited with your body then? More than anything. But the chances are so slim with the black cove utterly infested with Pontius's undead cronies. My poor lost body is among them, sightless and silent in their vile company. For all I know, they're using it as a cove rack. Traveler, if there were any way you would brave the cove's depths and reunite me with myself, you'd be doing me the only kindness I'd have received in as long as my poor memory serves. What do you know about Reginald? That charlatan doesn't have a lick of his own talent. So he begs, borrows, and beats it from those of us with a real vision for the stage. What I wouldn't give to give old Reggie a swift kick in the jugglers. Oh, to have legs again. It won't be the... Everything we do seems to fortify your abilities. I suppose your example has inspired me to uh, reach uh, reach heights I never uh, before envisioned. There's no experience to be won from pestering me with vapid flattery. Rude. Anyways. Level three. That was pretty rude. Anyways, um. Oh, we get a new tap. Oh, we get a new talent. Yeah, I have opportunities. I don't know why I didn't get a. Well, anyways. Um. Leech heals you when standing in blood. That might be pretty. That might be pretty good. A character with lone wolf can no longer have a companion, but receives a seventy percent bonus to base vitality, two bonus to turn action points, and a maximum action points and an extra ability point on level up. 
Huh. Morning person, when you, when resurrected, you revive with full health. That could be good later on. All skilled up. All skilled up gives you two extra ability points to spend. That's for grenade throws. I'm almost up for getting leech. I'm almost up for actually getting leech. Because there's, I mean, so far. Oh. Huh. And that's all good. Let's take a look at that. Let me take, let me take a look at something real quick. Hold on, chat. I want you. Do, 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 do. not showing it useful right now so we'll we'll we'll, we'll disregard that. um suppose i could grab this I suppose we could also grab courageous because I don't know how fear I don't know when fear fear is gonna kick in but it, it definitely could
I might have found something. I might have found something that'll help. Requires level, oh, level five. Arms too. Oh, oh. What's that require two men at arms? I'm able though if I get a uh, witchcraft I'll be able to I think I'll be able to actually I think I'll be able to grab like a vampiric touch for him that way he can get a heal so he doesn't have that great intelligence. So that's a bit unfortunate. So now we'll we'll go ahead and get uh extra man at arms and then we'll get picture health. Picture of health. Boom. Uh three percent uh man at arms extra vitality. Oh, wow. Woo. That's a, that's a lot of health right there. Now we're just going to continue. Okay. So yeah, he's going to, he's, he's going to be, he's going to get, he's going to get beefy real quick. And now you're up. Apparently, it is suggesting that, if, that I should get far out for my mages and maybe even elemental affinity. Okay, this. Um. Okay. Okay.
Interesting. Uh, every character needs at least 7 speed and 8 quantum optimized start AP and AP again. You only get an extra turn AP on uneven speed scores. 7. Okay, already went for that. So she would, she'll need, a, she'll need three con. He'll need two more points. Ugh. So I suppose. Okay. Uh, what was bully again? A bully boosts non-magical attacks by 50% against opponents with slowed, crippled, or knocked down. Oh. That might be the next one we get with our, uh, with Z. You, however... I guess we will go ahead and go get and get uh, far out. Uh, you still only have one point here. So, um, I want to get the probably hi, probably hydrosophis so we can get teleport. No, teleports in. I think teleports in arrow thirge. The regenerate skills in Hydro Sophist. 